in my previous video I explained what happens when something is depreciating or decreasing its in value uh, continuously. Now let's think about a different situation where something is increasing continuously. An investment pays interest at the rate of 9.8 percent per annum compounded continuously. How long will it take for an investment of 15,700 to triple in value? So the formula, if you remember the formula is like this, P is equal to P sub naught times e to the power rt as I explained in the last video if something is increasing continuously you use plus rt and if it is decreasing you put minus rt okay so r is a rate of interest as a decimal so this is 9.8 percent and if you want to write this as a decimal this is 99.8 over 100 this is same as 98 over 1000. So it, R should be written as a decimal, which is 0 0.098. So even if you don't understand differential equation, if you use this formula, you can get, you can solve any question like this. So the question is, P is your initial value, so P sub naught here, is 15,700. So let's put these two in this equation. So P is equal to 15,700 times e to the power 0.098t. Just like that. So now the question is, when P is 3 times 15,700, so let me write 3 times 15,700, whatever that number is, doesn't matter. We want to find the T. That's the question. So let's put this in this equation so we can see well. Uh, 3 times, oops, 3 times, 3 times, uh, 3 times 15,700. That's the tr tripling means 3 times is equal to 15,700 times e to the power 0 0.098t. So if you divide both sides by 15,700, so this and this gets cancelled. So what is the remaining is 3 is equal to e to the power 0 0.098t. Now taking log on both sides, the natural log, so natural log of 3 is equal to natural log of e to the power 0 0.098t. Okay, so we're almost there. So this becomes natural log of 3 using the log rule. This is 0 0.098t times natural log of e. And natural log of E has a base of E, so this is 1. This is going to be 1. So I can say, I'll write it here, natural log of 3 is equal to 0.098t. So now dividing both sides by 0.098. You can divide this side by 0.098. So that will give you your t. So you can say t is this divided by this. So let's use a calculator. So natural log of 3 divided by 0 0.098. Natural log of 3 divided by 0 0.098, which is 11.2 years. So it takes 11.2 years. 11.2 years for this investment to triple of 41,200 or something to become what is 15,700 times 3 is how much times 3 is 47,100 so for 15,700 to become 
47,100. It takes 11.2 years if that investment is increasing, compounding continuously at the rate of 9.8% per annum.